Hello. Hello, good morning. Can I speak to Mr. Fraser, please? Okay. Well, Mr. Fraser, hello, good morning. It's Sky Television Installation Department here. You're speaking with Ron today. How are you doing? I'm very well. How are you, sir? Oh, not too bad, not too bad. Have you got time to talk to me? Yeah, no, but yeah. Okay, it was uh, just a couple of points uh, regarding the proposed installation on February the 22nd. Uh, I just wanted to run over a, a couple of details with you, if that's all right. All right, I thought the installation was going ahead on 31st of January. Well, the date I've got in front of me on the screen is Wednesday the 22nd of February. Oh, no, I've had letters out in the beginning at uh, 31st of January. I've got it, and I was just on that, because I was actually signed in this morning to track my router, and it's been delivered to my house this morning. 31st, there's two, an engineer coming out in the morning for the phone, and then an engineer coming out in the morning for the sky, and an engineer coming out in the afternoon for the phone. You understand that we're busy, and we can't drop everything and come round? Oh, you can't. The boy says to the third, it's all booked in. Is there ample car parking for vehicular access outside the property? Plenty of parking, yeah. Can I ask if you have any pets in the property, please? No, no pets. Dogs in particular? No. Because that can invalidate the insurance policy. All right, OK, no, no. No dog. <laughs> Sorry, you said no dogs? No dogs. I'm pretty sure I heard a dog in the background, Mr Fraser. No dogs here, I'm afraid. <laughs> Oh no, Mr. <coughs> Mr. Fraser, I'm hearing that dog again. <laughs> Definitely no dog. <laughs> Are you telling me you can't hear a dog? I'm telling you I can't hear a dog. <laughs> God no. Who's this? There it is again in the background. <laughs> no, nah, sorry. I want you to be honest. I'm to sorry, but I don't have any dogs. I'm being serious. <laughs> There it is again, Mr. Fraser. <laughs> None to do with me, I'm sorry. <laughs> Must be a dog outside your office. <laughs> well, I'm in a call centre, sir. <laughs> I'm hearing it again, sir. <laughs> sorry, there's definitely no dogs here. You may think this is quite funny, but uh, I have to tell you that if you're not being absolutely 100% with me, then you know, we're going to have to cancel the date. <laughs> I'm sorry, but it's definitely no dog are, here. Are you telling me you can't hear a dog in the background? Must be. I don't know. It's definitely not from here. <laughs> this is a wind-up, isn't it? <laughs> Who's this? <laughs> Who's this? Nicky, it's Robin Galloway here. Oh, you're joking. <laughs> <laughs> Got a little email from Ria. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm gonna kill her. And <laughs> <laughs> the dog. Great. Brilliant. <laughs> Absolutely brilliant. <laughs> so you're moving into your new place very soon. I'm sure you'd be very happy there. Cheers, though. <laughs> just, just watch out for the dogs. <laughs> Thank you. Gotta go. See you later, Robin. Bye. Bye. <laughs> Roy Neal is in Houston with this late report. Jack Lausma's first report came this morning, and as the astronauts woke up, they found that flight planners had changed days, putting the actions originally planned for tomorrow into today's schedule instead. Yesterday's schedule was a lot harder than expected. Well, that's live television for you.